Welcome back to a brand new video. I haven't really covered Leroy in quite a while for album updates. We're not speculating that the album is gonna be dropping in 2023 in January. We can at least confirm that the album is named the first time. Obviously he has the line in the song, I don't know that the album is coming 2022 or whatever. And turns out that might end up being Cap. Album 2022. He did make a new Instagram though called Until the First Time and he posted a new snippet on it. Again, confirming the name of the album, he went ahead and tweeted that the first time is gonna be two installments. Now that could mean a couple different things, which is a little weird and doesn't clarify too much, um, but it could be released similar to Kendrick Lamar's album where just the story of the album is kind of two parts, but it drops together. It could be like that. Um, it could be like the F Love series where the album drops and then it's a deluxe, or it could even be uh, an EP or just some throwaway songs to hold us off until the album drops in January, which that's honestly what I hope it ends up being. Leroy posted on Instagram that tour is finally over. I went on the tour. I was at the Kansas City show like a month ago. I vlogged it. Go check it out if you haven't already. That was a great video on the channel. This was Leroy's first tour ever. He absolutely killed it. Um, the only thing was he didn't really have any new songs to perform. He did perform at every show the song What Just Happened, which is still unreleased. He did say though that he's gonna be filming the music video for What Just Happened when he gets back from his festival run over in Asia. So the music video should be dropping soon, which is good news. We know he wants a feature on it, so it could end up being Post Malone. A lot of people are campaigning for Ian Dior, which I think would be very dope. I'd love to see them two on a song together. I honestly want the song to be solo if we have to keep it real, but it does look like Leroy was trying to find a feature. Um, I wasn't riding for it too hard when the snippet was brand new. I was someone who really wanted a song like Guess It's Love to release, which, you know, I'm still waiting on that. We know when that song finally drops that that is going to be the lead single. We will finally, finally, finally be in the rollout to the album. So we're going to cover it when that song drops. Leroy went ahead and said A Thousand Miles is not going to be on the album. He did say A Thousand Miles would have a acoustic bonus track version, which I'm all for. I would really like to see what that sounds like and how that would kind of fit into the album. So I'm all for that. That could be beautiful and better than the original, to be honest. I don't have too many more updates. That's kind of all we have. It's not the craziest album news. Obviously, I'm going to cover when he drops what just happened and the more new songs he's going to drop this year because we do know that that is at least coming in 2022. For me, though, I just want new songs from Leroy. Obviously, A Thousand Miles dropped back in April. We had a few other features, which were good, and he's on some of the best songs this year. But you know, for Leroy, it's like Stay came out and F Love Part 3. All that came out last summer, I think last July. And then it's just like, we have one other like single from him, you know. I don't think he should wait too long to release. I know he's been busy with tour and I know he's constantly been changing what he's been doing or the direction of the sound that he wants to go. I know he wants to make it perfect and the best he possibly can, which I absolutely love for him. And I'm here to support. Like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching all the way to the end of the video. And I'll catch you guys soon. Peace.